Isabel Clara Eugenia um, um, was the, the daughter of Philip II, and so uh, she was a very prominent uh, figure in European politics. Uh, she was given the entire Netherlands as a dowry. This portrait is um, a study in female beauty, in female um, uh, body, but also uh, a study on uh, power, on a representation of uh, the physical body as uh, the body of the nation and the body of empire. And I think we can see that in the uh, geometrical shape of the clothing. Uh, embroidered in uh, fantastic colors uh, with a uh, gold and uh, silvery white and um, red colors uh, being prevalent. And that may be also a reflection on the canon of physical beauty in um, courtly love poetry and literature where typically different parts of the body would be associated with different um, colors and elements. Uh, therefore. For instance, the lips would be associated with red or with ruby, or with roses, red roses. Uh, the forehead would be associated with uh, white, uh, with uh, lily flowers, or with pearl. Uh, and the eyes would be associated with diamonds, uh, the hair would be associated with gold, and so forth. We can see all that in the painting, because it's the painting of um, um, uh, Coelho, who's working within that uh, literary um, atmosphere. But um, it is also very interesting to note her demeanor and her position. How is she um, negotiating the space uh, between uh, her maid, uh, her um, position in the center of the painting, and us as, as spectators. It's almost as if she's holding a power and supporting, transferring that power to the people around her. And, and by doing so, communicating that uh, sense of power onto the uh, public, who um, is us watching her. <laughs>